Hey everybody, so today I'm here to do my first baby haul for this pregnancy, which is pretty crazy for me to say. I can't believe I'm saying it again. But if you are new to my channel, more videos, I'm 15 weeks pregnant with our third baby girl and I have already accumulated some stuff. So in effort to not make the baby hauls extremely long, I'm just going to split them up when I get a decent amount of stuff. So here we go. Got this whole big bag right here. I'm just going to work from the top down. And the first two things I wanted to mention were some sweet gifts from you guys. So the very first thing is that I got some amazing, amazing cookies from Sunny over at Sugar Doodles. She sent this adorable card. She sent us these incredible themed cookies that were just so so cute with the girls names on them and she specifically told me to, you know like she wasn't doing this for any kind of shout out or anything but she makes such beautiful cookies i can't not say anything i follow her i'm pre-ordering for teacher appreciation day i love love her work the cookies were not only beautiful but they were delicious too like i was kind of expecting Oh, okay, well, these are well decorated, but if they don't taste great, that's okay. But no, they tasted amazing. So I'm going to hold up Sunny's business card along with linking this below as well. She takes orders by email and stuff. And if you follow her on social media, you'll see what she's offering at the time. And she also does custom orders, but she books out like months in advance. So definitely check her out. Like I said, her work is amazing. I just couldn't believe that she had put all those work into those incredible cookies. The girls squealed the whole time when they were looking at them. And they kept eat like when we would give them a cookie each night, they were like, this cookie's from Sunny. Thank you, Sunny. <laughs> so cute. But thank you, Sunny. Those cookies were delicious, amazing, beautiful. Thank you for thinking of us. So I want to make sure to mention that. And the next thing that is from one of you guys is from Brittany. And she actually got this off of my baby registry. I got a lot of people on Instagram asking if I could post it in case you guys wanted to get me something, which please do not ever feel obligated, but I will share it with you guys. I made it so I could get the 15% off coupon. So when I go to order stuff, it's cheaper. I do that with every pregnancy. I'm in it for the coupons, people, because baby stuff ain't cheap. But she went on there and got the baby bum brushes. That I know I've talked to you guys about before. Let me take it out of the bag so it's not so reflective. Which I'm super glad she did because Mark was kind of giving me a hard time about this. He's like, that is so silly. Like, no, we don't need that. And I was like, oh, I don't know if I can order it and like get away with it. But Brittany got it for us. So now we have it. So this combo pack came with this big brush that I'm going to keep in our bedroom and then it came with one in a little travel case which I'm going to put in like our diaper caddy so it can be out here in the living room and then she also did send us our favorite diaper rash cream which is the air organics if you have been around for a while this will not be new to you this stuff is amazing my youngest had eczema in her diaper region when she was younger and this was literally the only thing that helped it it also helped with obviously every other rash and stuff like that but I did want to say a big thank you to Brittany and Sunny for doing that thinking of us you guys are so so sweet and then on to the next thing I'm just pulling straight from the top the next thing is these La Vie breast massagers now if you guys remember I did a video on their first generation or something like that kind of breast massager a while back I'll link that if you are in the breastfeeding journey right now because it's super helpful but they sent me these warming lactation massage pads so these are different than what I've already reviewed so this is what it looks like on the inside you pop these boys out so this is the side that you would put against your breast. Super soft, super soft. And then when you turn them on, they vibrate and they also are warming as well. Obviously, I have not tried them, but I'm very excited too because I think these could be a huge help if I end up having vasospasms again or just in general, you know? Like I loved their regular massagers, so why wouldn't I love one that I could just stick on my boob and not have to worry about? So that's really cool and I'm really excited to try these i'll have these linked down below too along with the review that i've already done la vie is killing it over there with the breastfeeding accessories so thank you very much for that my grandma went to arizona and she got the girls some stuff so she came back with stuff for lexi as well but she got this little strawberry sleeper for her which is really cute and then 
she got her this little granimals outfit with the giraffes and then Remy actually already has these leggings which were a hand-me-down from Sophie so I think that's really cute if I could get them in the same pair at the same time but thank you so much grandma she actually got me this sweater too from Target that says mama on it and I really love it it's super comfortable so that was all the gifts and very much appreciated so I want to make sure to point that out this is the first thing I bought on my own when I knew it was a girl so I got this Lulu knit blanket newborn set. So basically it comes with a blanket, a hat, and the mittens. I really wasn't in it for the mittens, just the hat and the blanket. So, but you can see this color. I wanted to go with this color for Lexi because we did pink with Sophie and purple for Remy. And then I felt like this kind of burgundy kind of color was an in-between of pink and purple a little bit. I don't know, stretching here, but whatever. Anyways, I really wanted this kind of swaddle blanket for her, and I'm not so much a bow person. Even with having three girls, I prefer hats when they're newborns because they do lose so much heat from their head if they don't have one on. So I wanted to get a nice little hat and swaddle blanket set, and I liked how this blanket was ribbed as well. So it's got a little bit of a different texture on it. I think it's going to be really nice and cute. So that was the first thing I personally bought by myself when I knew it was a girl. This will look familiar if you watched our gender and name reveal along with telling the girls that we were pregnant. But I found this onesie that also came with this onesie at Target. And I actually found these first and I was like, oh, these are so cute. And then I was like, no, I, they don't have any matching shirts for the girls. I went over to clearance and I found the girls' shirts, which was just crazy to me. And I felt like it was a sign. So Lexi has her own little Jack Jack suit and then this one, which is whatever. I was in it for the one that looks exactly like the girls' shirt, this one. I think technically the first thing I ever bought f during this pregnancy, I bought it not knowing that I was pregnant. And it's actually up in like our baby box or whatever you want to call it. Stuff we've collected over the year of trying. If you guys want to see what's in that, let me know. Because that's a totally different video. But this, I think, was the first thing I bought knowing I was pregnant. And it's this little sleeper. It's like a thermal. And I love thermals. Because I feel like they can be really warm. But they're also pretty lightweight as well. So they can fit for a lot of different... Uh, you know, temperatures, but it does have the mittens on the end. I got it from Target. Just thought it was super cute. Either way, boy or girl. And then this was the only thing besides some nail clippers. <laughs> These nail clippers we got at Target. These are my favorite. These are still what I use on the girls and I can't ever find them anywhere. So when I saw Target had them, I grabbed more. But this was the only thing we bought at Target. We got this Burt's Bees sleeper and does Burt's Bees only make zero to three months? We couldn't find any newborns, so I'm going to assume that's what they make. But, oh, okay. Probably, because they've got the mittens on the back. But, yeah. This was the only one that we got when we went shopping after finding out it was a girl. Or she was a girl. But, yeah. Mark really thought that this was adorable. So, this was the only thing we got from Target that time. And then we went over to Carter's, and that's where the rest of this is from. So the first thing that I got was pants. And uh, you're going to be able to see a pattern here. So basically, I got three different sizes of basically the same kind of pants. So I got newborn, three months, and six months. All in these kind of heather, whitish, gray kind of color sweatpants. These are amazing. If I'm going to put my newborn in sweatpants, this is what I'm going to put them in. Even at three months, it matches so much. I had a similar kind of set with the girls, but I couldn't find it at Carter's, so I just went with this. And I use these so much. So they had a sale on, the bit, on these, so I just decided to get one in each size. And then something that we loved with Remy was the side snap onesies I got because if there's a chance that I'm going to actually put her in clothes as a newborn, it's going to be with these side snap onesies. I don't mess with onesies over the head when they're a newborn, honestly. So we got this pack. I'm not, we aren't super crazy about the cats, but whatever, or even this one. This was like the best we could do in Carter's and we were like, we really liked this black one. 
I don't know. The other ones aren't bad, I guess. But anyways, it's kind of like a dark, dark gray color. But we really like these side snap ones because you don't have to try to lift their floppy little dome inside of stuff. So it was actually on clearance too. So we got pretty lucky there. But side snap onesies in case she needs an outfit. And those sweatpants go with all of those onesies. And then we got some sleepers as well. I'm glad that I went up and I looked at our clothes before we went shopping because we do not basically have anything from newborn to three months. Everything else I'm like well stocked on, but both the girls had a reflux, so they ruined quite a bit of their newborn three month clothes. So I don't have a ton. I have like no newborn sleepers, so that's why I helped myself to quite a few. The first newborn sleeper we got was this unicorn one. I mean, come on, it's got unicorn rainbows. And then little unicorn feet. Must. It's a must. And then I couldn't not when I saw this because she is our rainbow baby. I believe this is, oh, it's newborn. It looks big for newborn. But really, really cute. I liked that one. And then this one is in three months. And it was the only little sister one that I actually liked. Wasn't really liking any of the others. I think, yeah, this was on clearance as well. But that is everything that we got from Carter's. And that's my first baby haul. Honestly, it's not too much. But I've been, like, letting myself buy a little at a time. I feel like with Remy, I was going hard really quickly. And then I was like, I have all this stuff to find a space for. But with both the girls being in their own rooms, I don't really have a spot for it. So it stays in my room. And it has slowed me down quite a bit. But yeah, I just wanted to share this with you guys because it's been really fun shopping for her and finding stuff for her and stuff like that. If you guys have any ideas for pregnancy or baby related videos, leave them down in the comments below. I will definitely take a look at them. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And as always, thanks for watching.